in the sticks we got to come out the woods to hunt. <laughs> no, a little town called Three Rock Cove. Not me. If you blink, you passed it. <laughs> yeah, but I'm Lars Benoit. 
from uh, West Bay also, Robert's brother. Are you? Been, been in Ontario for <laughs> 37 years and uh, also played with the Carlton Show Band for 11 years. Yeah, you did, didn't you? Yeah. Robert, both you and Robert. Yep. Robert, Robert. And Roddy. Right. And Roddy. Roddy. Roddy, yes. That's After right. he left the Caribou, I believe, Roddy right? yeah. yeah. left the Caribou. That's right. So this was a funny story. I remember we had the club on the lakeshore. It was called the Newfoundland Club uh, across the McDonald's. Anybody remember it at all? In no, Newfoundland. It was the Big Land Ballroom. Yeah. I, I, I don't know. Yeah, yeah, I do. Back in the day, the, Car uh, the Carlton Show Band used to use it for their rehearsals. Mm -hmm. So Sean and all the guys would come there. But of course, most people that remember the Carlton Show Band was from the Pig and Whistle days. Yep. And back then, it, there was, uh, they were all Irish except Freddie, Freddie White. That's right. And of course, what's happened over the years is, so Marsh, I think Chris left, Chris O'Toole, Christy McLaughlin. And the final product that I remember right, when you guys went on tour in Newfoundland, you did the uh, Arts and Culture Center. Yeah. It was pretty much all Newfoundlanders in that band. Pretty well. <laughs> Wasn't there? We, we took so over. You took over. So there was yourself and Laris and, and Laris, Roddy, Roddy and Freddie, which Freddie, was down east. That's right, Freddie White. They were all East Coasters. Yeah, Aaron, that was Aaron, the, Aaron Lewis. Oh, and Aaron. Which is right, Bobby, Aaron. Bobby Lewis's uh, yeah, son. son yeah. Second mm -hmm. generation. So the only one left was Greg, I believe. Greg was the, well, he wasn't the original, but he was the, the only Irish guy. He's the only Irish guy in the yeah. band. Yeah. The That's quite you know, a story. So, yeah. so these ball. guys yes. are anybody wondering if you see them before? It's because they were with. How long were we with them for? About ten years. Yeah, I was about. Uh, how long have you been? There? Well, 11, 11 years. Eleven. 11 years. Years. I was probably about uh, maybe twelve. Wow, yeah. amazing. Yeah, and, and then course, Roddy was with him a little while. Now, of course, uh, twenty years. Turn. Roddy, you're tell us about sixteen. Sixteen. I'm from West Bay, the same. Oh, you're from West. I thought it was well, Steve Will Crossing. He's our uncle. Steve Will. He's the uncle, right? Yeah. Uh, yeah. They're my nephews. These They're your nephews. Yeah. Yes. Mm -hmm. yeah. yeah. I was Steve. mayor of Westby for a while. Mayor. <laughs> <laughs> so, according to Tommy, uh, Terry Hines. <laughs> according yeah. To Terry, yeah. Terry, and Terry, and Terry. And of course, there. Terry is from there as well, right? Yeah, Port of Port. Another Port Port. a member of the yeah. band that worked with us for many years. And Tommy. And Tommy, was a great, yes, great, great musician yeah, from great the, musicians. Oh, yeah, a lot oh, yeah. of talent in that, yep. that oh, yeah. uh, West Coast. Beautiful. Yeah. Anyway, guys, I'm going to let you get back to it, so uh, go right for it. On. I'll just step out of the way here. <laughs> Play one of your old mans. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you. 
Huh? Yes, sir. You did them straight. Good stuff. with Robert so that's how I uh, came about uh, coming here so um, but I live in Kirkfield right now so very good so how yeah. did you um, is it the accordion did it come um, to so my grandfather played for years and then when he passed away uh, my grandmother brought one of the accordions to my family there were six kids in her family and she just said anybody that can get anything out of it um, can have it so just Playing around, I got Pop Goes the Weasel, and then uh, from there, uh, with your brother's uh, Harry Hibbs albums, just playing the record and nice. figuring tunes out that way, yeah. Well, I mean, a lot of people I know from the coast did it that way, but it's funny that you're from Ontario. And yep. Have a Harry yep. Album so, yeah, when I first got the accordion, I'm like, I didn't know anybody that played uh, accordion, but I remember Dad playing the Harry Hibbs record, so awesome. that's how that's I so came about, yeah. Mm. Right. yeah. And here he is today. Yeah. <laughs> we can okay. grab gold slippers. <laughs> Thank you. 
Run that one. <laughs> I gotta get you to play the spoons. I heard. You. Okay, now we got a little surprise here. Mr. <laughs> Felix Turner is gonna do us a little bit of his guitar rendition. So let's hear what you got to offer there, Felix. Alright, buddy. I expect too much. <laughs>
next tune I'd like to do for you is a tune by Smiley Bates. I guess everybody knows Smiley Bates. Uh, it's called Flat Top Chimes. And it was requested by one of my favorite uh, uncles. I gotta say that because he's right next to me. <laughs> but anyway, there's a, a tune called Flat Top Chimes.
what we're doing. Thanks, buddy. Yeah.
Love you.